Tonight, Arizona Republican Congressman Eli Crane posting a video on X from the roof. It's not that steep at all. Where a gunman fired at former President Donald Trump at a rally in Pennsylvania on July 13th. See that water tower behind me? Had Secret Service or anybody had sniper teams up there, this guy wouldn't have made it um, five feet up this roof. Crane, also a former Navy SEAL sniper, showing another angle from a building overlooking the roof, calling out the Secret Service for letting the shooter slip through its fingers. Both of Crane's videos viewed by more than a million people. Do you solemnly swear? The same day, the Secret Service Director Kimberly Sheetle testified before a House committee. The assassination attempt of former President Donald Trump on July 13th is the most significant operational failure of the Secret Service in decades. Lawmakers on both sides of the aisle grilled Sheetal for answers on what went wrong, including Arizona Republican Representative Andy Biggs, who did not like what she had to say at the hearing. As someone who said the buck stops with me, I'm going to stay in my job, I'm going to give the answers to the American people, and I know what happened. Except for you're not going to tell us. You're not going to tell the American people. I call upon you to resign today. Today. Arizona Democratic leaders echoing the push for Sheetal to step down. Representative Greg Stanton saying she has lost my confidence in that of the American people. She should resign. And Ruben Gallego saying as head of the Secret Service, Director Sheetal has the solemn responsibility to protect our nation's leaders. And she has failed. During the hearing, she said she has not visited the site since the assassination attempt. That's another detail she is being criticized for. And Crane was one of a dozen state representatives to tour the site today. Reporting live in the newsroom, Casey Torres, Arizona's family.